Hi guys, Pugpill here, and welcome back to Feed the Beast Horizons Daybreaker. We are back, and we have a spider somewhere, because it keeps hissing. Um, so yeah, but, uh, what have I been doing between episodes? Well, I've been clearing this area up a little bit, hoping that I could sort it, but, uh, seems that the furnace only uses free process, where this one uses 60, so, uh, yeah, that one's a thing. And the other thing, I will show you downstairs in a minute, the other thing is this bit. I finally finished the upstairs a bit more, I just need a roof and stuff, unless I want to make it three stories, because I very much might with one of the mods that is in here, so, um, might. Hello, Mr. Spider, I can't kill you, because you're too tall. I made this up here, though, so that we could go a little bit higher. And down here, we're going to have our factory, or our proper factory area. So we have some Futura blocks here, and we also have some bit blocks from Z-Tone, which, uh, which aren't too hard to make. They're basically just the Z-Tone blocks around a piece of wool, and if you want to know how to get the Z-Tone blocks... Uh, have I got any stone? Uh, yes, I do. Good. Right, so let's just make some of these because I will need some more anyway. So to make these, you are going to need stone slabs. Make them into a formation like so. And then put some stone in the middle and there you go, Z-Tone tiles. And then you can put those around a piece of wool and it will give you bit blocks. But we're not going to get bit blocks. Not this time. Not yet, anyway. So, uh, what have I been wanting to do for this episode is to get a couple of ingots and stuff. So, let's get a few iron. I think this only works for, like, one. I'm not sure. I can't remember. So, let's put some... Oh, no, I don't want that on there. I want it on the processor. Give me your back. There we go. Right, so, let's stick a few iron ingots down. I don't know how many I'll need. Stick that on there. And now we need to power this. So... I guess we'd better get some of those crystals that we got last episode. There we go, 13. That should do it. Uh, let's get a few coal. Blub, 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 blub. Stick a couple in you. Let's just stick three in you. And uh, there we go. Right, so stick you down and poof. This should start making up. It'll take a lot of power. There we go, one. Two. Okay, this is going to be very slow. Holy shit. Right, okay, we'll leave that there for now. And other thing. Oh, starting back up. Good, good. Because I don't want to lose this world. I did lose this world again, but luckily I had a backup this time, so that was fortunate. Right, anyway, today I want to create some upgrades for my machines because they need them. Right, so we need to get some enriched alloy, two glass per thing, so enriched alloy, so uh, let's get some redstone. Some ready redstone, I picked up too much there, but whatever. So let's stick in about, I uh, don't want that much, we want about, let's say four, because then we can get two upgrades. Oh, we got carbon in here, get rid of that. And then stick a couple of those in. Hopefully we will have enough for this. And, oh, we can actually make another block, uh, another machine. I forgot about that. So I don't know what machine I should make. Should I make, should I make, should I make? Reactor frame, okay. Combiner, osmium compressor or whatever that was. Uh, digital miner, crusher. A crusher would probably be the one that I need. Uh, Energized smelt we've already got. Oh, a pump. A pump could come in very handy when we get to the nether stages. I'm thinking a pump right now, so we need two of the... Oh, God, we don't need more. Osmium ingots and a bucket. That shouldn't be too hard to make, I hope. So, uh, with that said, let's get a couple more of those in. There we go. Right, has this made up? That has indeed made up. Uh, we didn't get many, though. We only got one. Uh, we need a bit more wool for this, then, I'm guessing, because we need about five. So, uh, for our chest upgrades, I don't believe that I've shown you this. Um, we need a basic upgrade, which is just cobblestone around a piece of paper. So, if we just grab those, there we go. 
and then to upgrade even more for like let's say iron level then just put iron around it and we'll get iron upgrade but for now i believe we have enough chest space that we won't need that so let's hope that we do so let's have a look uh we can stick our stuff back into here Get rid of those, get rid of those, get rid of that, get rid of theirs. Okay, we do need that. And uh, we also need some glass, so... Eh. Okay, so for this, two of those either side. Glass on the top and the bottom, and osmium dust in the middle will give us a speed upgrade, or two to be precise. So, now we have our speed upgrade, let's go over here and uh, stick it inside, let's see, enrichment chamber or energized smelter. I guess we'll stick it in our energized smelter. This will make our energized smelter slightly faster in the form of, let's stick this in, yeah that's a lot faster, holy crap. But we could get a few more of these, I just need the materials for it. So I guess... Mm, I don't know if I want to get rid of most of my iron or not. I don't really want to, but... But... For science! And I mean, we could do a bit more mining and stuff as well, so... Uh, I guess we'll use a bit more iron. Get another four of those. There we go. So, stick it in here, stick that in there. We'll get another speed upgrade, this time for that machine instead. So let's just stick this in here, this will hopefully make this a little bit quicker. And there we go, holy shit, that jump started it. Right, okay, we can get one more upgrade. Probably, if we have enough glass, which we currently don't. Uh, wrong chest. There we go, just enough glass, holy. Holy moly. Right, so there we go, speed upgrade. Let's just stick this in the furnace, because, I mean, the furnace is the thing we're going to use the most, right? So, those, and we need, uh, eh, eh, uh, what did we need? Bucket, a couple more pieces of osmium, and our casing, oh, I'll also grab that, uh, casing, 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 there we go, casing. So, casing in the middle, osmium on the bottom, and bucket on the top will give us a electric pump. Woohoo! Right, so, you will see that we have this, a blind bag tier 1. Now, this is from Project Superhuman, which will give us a piece of a superhero outfit. So, let's right-click this. Harley Quinn's mallet. Not what I wanted at all. Okay, so I sort of want to get my uh, stone miner set up again, this time with a few upgrades. So let's see if we can upgrade this thing. Uh, I know that we need redstone. So let's see, is it like this or is it the other way? No, it's like that. Oh, jeez, that's going to be expensive for wood. Uh, right, so we've got the wooden upgrade. We now need the stone upgrade. So I can't remember if it's cobble or if it was just plain old smooth stone. So let's get both of them. And we can test this out. Let's check. Nope, not cobblestone. Okay, it's going to be smooth stone then. So with one of these, you'll be able to upgrade the amount that a machine does. Uh, da -da -da, okay. So, I guess the way that we can use this would be to get ourselves. Let's grab those to start with. Yep, grab those. Right, so, there should be another type of upgrade that is basically a energy upgrade, but I don't know how to do it, so let's see, is there a way of getting it? Okay, so what we need is an RF engine, so uh, we can get this by uh, six iron, da, da, da. okay, let's give this a try, we are going to spend most of our resources on this, I believe, but it might be worth it, it might not, so let's get a block of redstone, so for that we need nine, so, nine dust equals black of redstone, gold either side, and then iron on the tops and the bottoms will give us an RF engine. Okay, right, hopefully this will be cool. 
Um, what I'm thinking I might actually do, just to make my life a little... Mm, that might not make my life easier at all. So, for the miner, we needed a couple of things. One being uh, the pickaxe and the other being a shovel. So, hopefully I've got enough stuff there for that. So, go in there. There we go. Sticks. So, pickaxe. Okay, apparently I got an achieve. And shovel. Okay, let's see if we can get this baby to work. Hopefully we can. So, I'm gonna go outside, I'm gonna get my leadstone stuff, and we're gonna trail this out a little bit, because we don't want it ruining the landscape. So, I guess here we'll do fine. Yeah, why not? It's not gonna be very big radius anyway, so let's get our stone miner hooked up. That won't connect at the moment, but... Wait, didn't I get my redstone engine thing? Okay, let's get our redstone engine thing. We'll stick that in and... Okay, there we go. It's charging up. That goes inside the fuel slot. Uh, we can upgrade that, so that's now range 2. Needs cobble. Give it cobble. Give it those. And it should start mining. Yay! So, now we get a 2 area instead. That's not apparently connected, even though it is. So, that's fully charged. And we are getting resources. Hell yeah! So unfortunately this will only mine stuff that is on the level of cobble, uh, but hopefully later on we'll get a few things. But we got some different resources, we got some coal which is good, um, ooh, we got some elemental gems, hopefully we'll get some iron out of that so we got a bit of a return. Okay, so I think the next thing that I'm going to want to get is a wooden chopper. So, uh, for this, we are going to need some resources once again. We're going to need another furnace. And we're going to need a chest and a thing there. So, right, okay. Let's just grab. Gravity grab. Uh, spruce planks. Have we got any other planks? No, we don't. Okay, I might be getting a little low on resources for this. So, for this, we are going to need... We're going to need... A wooden axe. Uh, we're going to quickly go outside and chop some trees down, I think. Okay, there we go. We just chopped a fir tree down, and we chopped a couple of other things down as well. How's this doing? Uh, we don't have that much still. Um, I guess I could do another upgrade now since I've got enough wood for that sort of thing, so let's go! And uh, this episode is going to be a lot about upgrades. Um, right, let's see. Fur, so uh, we need a chest for this, I believe, so let's just get one of those real quick. Chest at the top, furnace in the middle, wooden axe at the bottom, and logs either side. It will give us a wooden chopper. And then to upgrade this, we will need a stone axe, so let's just quickly grab ourselves one of those. Um, like so. We're going to actually need two of these, so let's just do that. Derp derp. Oops. Derp. And doop. And there we go, stone axes. So that at the bottom. We want our wooden chopper in the middle. And then I believe it's just stone around the outside of that will give us our stone chopper. There we go. And then while I'm here, I will create, if we got some redstone, there we go. We will get a couple of upgrades. There we go. And with these, we will upgrade these to the stone tier. Yeah, we got one. We need another one. Do we not have any more stone? I'm guessing not. Because uh, we're getting through that pretty quick. Right, let's put this in here and have that smelt up. That is so much quicker. Yeah. Okay, good. So, stone in there. And we just need a three more. There we go. We got three. Exactly what I needed. So, stick those in there. There we go. We got a stone upgrade. And we can quickly head outside and stick one of these into here. Actually, no, this, mm, I sort of want to, I sort of don't want to. Eh, whatever, we'll leave it for now. So, where do we want our tree farm to be? Well, I guess it's not going to be too big, so we can just stick it here for now. Yeah, we'll just use it on uh, coal at the moment. And we'll stick it there. 
And we need a accent here, like I mentioned earlier. We also need some of that. It chops, add tools. Uh, let's see, we need saplings. That's what we need. So saplings in there, that will start doing it. It's only got a range of one, so let's put one of those in there. It's now got a range of two. And I wonder if we could put any of our fir wood ones. No, we can't. Oh, shame. I was hoping to have a massive tree, but oh well. So this currently has a range of two. It will plant those and grow them and stuff. And I want to upgrade this one so we've got a bit more mining area to do. Um, I don't think I can make another thing at the moment. So I guess let's just chop another tree quick. So let's just real quickly head inside and get another one of our upgrades. Okay, there we go. Upgrade. So uh, we might want to go to bed. Okay, there we go. We are up, wake and ready. You can just go over here, stick this in the miner. Oh god, we need new pickaxe already. No! So stick that in there. Um, okay, so I guess stone isn't great, like I said earlier. It'll only mine stone stuff anyway, so uh, let's go in here and get ourselves a new pickaxe. And oh my god, guys, I think we got a problem. I think we might be out of cobblestone. Hmm, that could be a little bit digament. Right, I guess we can go down here and just grab some off the walls because I mean I'll be getting rid of this stuff anyway, so might as well put it to good use for now. So let's get all of this and all this. And here we go. And that should be enough for now, I guess. We'll just grab a couple more. Here we go. So stone pickaxe and we need food. Holy moly. Right, so apples, can these do much? Eh, yeah, they should do enough. Ah, let me out! There we go. Right, so let's have a look in here. Put that in. And there we go. We can now mine up to 300 blocks. So that is cool. This should be planting some cobblestone down, hopefully, if we've got enough. And uh, we haven't really got anything good. We've got coal, and that's it. So I'm not too pleased about that, but whatever. Um, the other thing I want to do is go and get some wool so I can actually get the aura cascade thing that I want. So for that, I will need some shears. I've got some already, so I will be right back. So it's quite typical that the one time that you need sheeps, they go extinct. So uh, yeah, I'm going to be searching a while, I believe. So guys, after very many minutes of searching, we finally come across some sheep. Holy crap, it took many minutes as well. Let's just grab all your wools, because I need it. Hopefully these guys won't attack me, will you? Because you're a hunter. Are you friendly? You're friendly, okay. That's good. I don't want you to kill me. All right, let's grab you, and grab you, and there's melons around this jungle, because we've got a jungle near our place, or not too far from it anyway. So let's get some melon. I want a melon. So uh, I guess we gotta head back now. Which half this place isn't loading. What the fuck is that thing over there? I haven't been exploring too too much. So yeah, but there's a thing over here, and it looks yellow. And what the fuck is this? It is a banana leaf. Ooh, banana. Banana. Right, let's see. Can we chop this down? I want to get some saplings for this because this looks cool. I don't know if we will get any. Oh, we got bananas. Yay. Okay, so in real life, I hate bananas, but in this game, they're awesome because they give me food. So let's just stick this crap in here. We may need a chest upgrade. I did say we might need one, so we might. But uh, let's just eat this, and then we will... Uh, what was I going to do? I was going to get that and make about five different red wool. Actually, I don't need five different red wool. I just need four, because we've already got one of the things that I want. So uh, let's go... Where did I put it? Oh, no. Don't tell me I lost it. Well, no, my clumsiness, I probably lost it, so we're just going to have to create another one. Right, so spruce wood, get that there, get the bowl at the bottom, and there we go, pestle and mortar. Stick that with the leaves, and there we go, floral dye, stick that with the wool, and there we go, red wool. Right, so we need about uh, five, no, four, four iron, 
And we need to fuel this thing up again, right? So iron there, wool there, and then we need to fuel it. Luckily, we've got enough coal for that. So that should start processing up in a moment. Oh, it's nearly at 60 already, which is good. There we go. And just a few more, and then hopefully we'll come to that in a few minutes and it will be finished. So one of the things I actually want to get started on is going to be some mine chem stuff. So for this, it's going to be a little bit pricey, I think. So let's get a few of those. Oh shit, we might actually need some more cobblestone for this, thinking about it. So those across the top. Um, I don't think we actually have any cobble at all at the moment. Shit. Okay, yeah, we might need some more cobble. So I believe that one of the things is made like that. Oh, no, that's an hourglass, apparently. <laughs> um, how was it made? Do, 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 do. Not like so. Ah, there we go. So we need a concave lens. We'll need a few different things. We'll need a concave lens, the microscope, projector. No, it wasn't a concave lens we needed at all, was it? Oh, shit. Okay, so I was right, we did need a concave lens, uh, and we also need a convex lens. So we need two of the convex lenses, which is about six different of those. So, Jesus Christ, there is so much noise coming from over there. So we need two of these, so like so. And then we will need to make ourselves a microscope. So like so, we'll get a microscope lens. And then for this, we need a load of iron and a glass pane. So we've got our iron in here. I will hopefully do some mining between episodes. And we need a glass pane. So let's get that. And then we should be able to get ourselves our microscope. Yay! So this is the first start to mine chem. Uh, I may be doing some more of this between or on different episodes, but I know that I need a lot of machines for mine chem. So, uh, right. So with this, we need a book. Okay, so the book is the chemist's journal. Uh, we need one glass and one book for this. Now, I don't think I have any books, but... We should be able to make some, hopefully, if I am correct, Amondo. So there we go. And we can create a book in here by putting free paper, one leather. And then one of those with a piece of glass will give us our chemist's journal. We can then stick that in here and we can start researching the different materials from around the world and what they have inside them. So the wool has glycine and titanium dioxide or dioxide, whatever. A ladder doesn't have anything, apparently. Wooden sla... Uh, okay, they have uh, cellulose. Glass should have silicone. Yeah, silicone dioxide. Glass painter... Uh, oh, also silicone dioxide. Stick? Nothing. Okay. So some things will have uh, materials, other things will not. So steak doesn't. Shears? Nope, doesn't. Um, but you can create th different things out of this, so some things you may be able to create into food uh, if you have like a synthesizer and stuff like that, so this should have carbon in it, there you go, and then that can be made down into different things. But each one of these is going into the chemist's journal, so let's have a look in here, you can see the different things that are in here. Some things won't have anything, other things will have stuff, so that's pretty cool. So I'll be doing research into this uh, in between episodes, but for now I'm going to go over here and grab my ingots, and I should have had five. Why do I only have four? Oh wait, no, 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 no. I have one in this chest here. Okay, good. Right, uh, what else do we need? Okay, so I believe we need to grab ourselves a diamond. We also need to grab ourselves free gold. And then we will end the episode after I've made this, guys, uh, like that. So, free gold across the top. We then need our arcane ingots like that. And a diamond in the middle will then give us a vortex controller from Aura Cascade. Ooh, this thing looks fancy. 
but we're not going to get too into that this episode because that will be saved for next. So, Vortex Infusion allows you to make higher tier items as well as arcane gems. So, this has given us four Vortex Pedestals, uh, which are these things, so we can put things onto here. So, let's stick this, I guess we'll stick it here for now. So, pedestal there, pedestal there, there, and there, we will get a better setup for this soon, but we actually need aura nodes across the top of these to actually get this thing to work. Recipe not selected. Oh dear. Uh, ugh, let's quickly get this quick, because I know what I need. So, let's stick in one, two, three of those, one of those, and then... Uh, we are making a arcane white gem, power received nothing, we need 20,000, holy shit. Okay. So, that is basically what we are going to be doing in the next episode, just for a little sneak peek. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, guys. And remember, hit the like button if you did. And subscribe for more videos coming in the future, as well as other stuff. Well... I'm not going to say other stuff because it's all going to be videos, but whatever. And uh, yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I have been Pokepeel. This has been Feed the Beast Horizons Daybreaker, the Pokepeel edition. And I will see you guys next time. So until then, bye!